Hey, Ben. Your tree was so hard. Yeah, she could hardly speak. Come, boy. She was her husband playing. Aren't you old and sad to play, said the boy? I want to prove to that that will take me far away from here. Can you give me a boat? Cut down my trunk and make a boat, said the tree. Then you can sail away and be happy. And so the boy cut out her branch, hit her trunk, and carried, him, carried it away. And the tree was happy. But not really. Not really. <laughs> not really. And the boy stayed away for a long time. And when he came back, the tree said, "I'm sorry, boy." I'm sorry, boy said the tree. Okay. But I, I don't have anything um, left to give you. Left to give you. My apples are gone, said the tree. My teeth are too weak for apples, said the boy. My brush are, my brushes are gone at the tree, but my aunt swing on them. I do old the swing on branches at the boy. My trunk is gone to the tree. It may not climb. Oh, Mommy. I'm too tired to climb at the boy. I'm sorry, said the tree. But I wish that I could give you something, but I have nothing left. And just an old stump. I'm sorry. I don't need very much now, said the boy. Just to quietly to sit and rest. Well, said she, straightening herself as much as she could. Well, an old stump is good for sitting and resting. Come, boy, sit down, sit and rest. And the boy did, and the Three was happy. Yay! <laughs> Good job. We did. You read that whole book. We read it. You read the whole thing. Yay, Ben. Wow. That was pretty impressive. I did it with Corel. You did it with Corel.